The fear of violence during the upcoming 2015 general elections had remained a serious threat to the core success of the polls, built up frustration by many families who have been directly affected by terrorism, poverty and the lack of education has over time given rise to huge grief and antagonism, especially towards the government or politicians. But ahead of this critical general election, the former Secretary General of the United Nations calls for calm. Walking away from politics or being frustrated with politics is common with many young people, even in your own country. There are some young people who are frustrated with politicians and with politics. But I would urge those despite in the Northeast who are frustrated that they should think it through, exercise their right to vote, and think, think about who can help them, how, which, which, which uh, party has a program, serious program of tackling the insurgency. Mr. Annan is confident that the nation's electoral empire, INEC, will not fail in its promise to work out a sound strategy that incorporates every eligible voter. Where the systems are weak and the people are not sure that their votes are going to count or the results are what it should have been, then you run into difficulty and it becomes difficult to govern because uh, your legitimacy as a leader or as a government is questioned. Africa has changed. People now understand what is going on. He equally enjoined the government to work towards diversifying the nation's economy. Nigeria has very dynamic and entrepreneurial uh, business class and they, and they should work with the government, the private public partnerships to really get the economy going, get into um, manufacturing agriculture which can create lots of jobs for the young people and work in diversifying the e e economy because we import a lot, not only in Nigeria, South Africa, we spend uh, $35 billion a year importing food when we have all the land around us and we can produce to feed ourselves. Well, the bane of the many discussions and advice by the African statesman is on how to repress violence during and after the elections. But what is certain to him as well is that the African continent will be positively affected if Nigeria gets it right at the general elections. Gloria Umezuke, Channels Television News.